I go to law school in New York and I'm studying international human rights law. I really wanted to travel and I thought that combining the traveling and the volunteering would be a really, really great opportunity to take a break from studying and to go see somewhere new and um, just give back a little. I am um, helping to develop a women's shelter. There are currently only about two in Ghana and domestic violence is a pretty severe problem in the country and so VPWA wants to start its own women's shelter. It's, it's a pretty big problem here and um, I think with, with domestic violence statistics anywhere it's always difficult to get a good idea of how accurate they are because it's something that very few people are willing to talk about openly, especially in this culture. Um, the most recent government study was done in 1999 and that came out with one in three women have been um, in some way abused by their partner and that nearly 50% of Ghanaian women believe that um, domestic violence is justified. So it's, it's a problem from a lot of different angles. We started by um, doing initial research, interviewing people, interviewing um, men and women, all different age groups, all different professions from all over Ghana. Um, and we just had very, very candid discussions about the subject of domestic violence and women's shelters and women's rights issues. And we got so much insight and really invaluable information from these people, especially we met a few women who really opened up to us about their own experience with domestic violence and so they were able to give us advice about how we could approach the project um, that I don't think we could have gotten otherwise. So we compiled all of that information and then started to actually do the conceptual design of the project framework as well as the physical structure of the shelter. And so what would you say to other people who were considering volunteer work? Oh, I mean, do it. I think volunteer work is fantastic. Um, You'll, you'll always get something out of it, and the best part about it is other people will too. What have you enjoyed most about Ghana? Most? Wow. Um, can I say a few things? <laughs> say as many as you like. <laughs> um, I'll start with the food. I was actually really surprised about, I'm a vegetarian, and I was a little bit worried about um, how I you know, cope with the food here. The food is so good. If you love spice, it is just really, really, really great. Um, the food definitely is great. Um, the traveling, I think, has probably been my favorite part of working here. You work really hard during the week, and then you have the weekend to go anywhere that you want. Um, and the volunteers here, you know, over dinner during the week, we'll sit down and take out our guidebooks and, you know, draw little, you know, routes along the maps and try and figure out what we want to do together. And you, you'll split up and you'll see amazing places. We, we've been to some lush green mountains and waterfalls and the coast. And I mean, it's, there's so much that it has to offer and there's so much you can see. And, but Ghana is, everyone will say, has the friendliest people that you'll ever meet. And it's very true, very true. It's, it's a genuine warmth. And one thing I want to know is, uh, where's our shower curtain? It is currently folded up under my bed and is ready to be hung up. I just need the rod. <laughs>